Welcome to Finding the Good Life. I'm Dr. Gene. If you own a pet, you know the pets, and they enrich our lives each and every day. We might not sit and philosophize about this or put into words exactly what they do for us, but we know it. And we know that our lives would not be the same without those beautiful animals that are an integral part of our families. And this isn't just a feeling. There's plenty of scientific evidence that shows that when pets are a part of people's lives, people are happier and healthier. There's a very special symbiotic relationship that exists between people and animals, and this has been seen throughout history. Nowhere is this more evident than in on a relationship with dogs. It's astounding to think that there are 900 million dogs in the world, 80 million in the U.S. alone. And there's a reason for that. Dogs, they look us directly in the eye. They cock their heads. They move their eyebrows in very magical ways. They show us affection. They prod us with their paws and their snouts. They communicate their needs. They give us love. And they respond to our affection. They're jealous of our attention. They loyally guard and protect us. It's no wonder that dogs and other animals have the power to affect people in profound ways, to the point that animals will actually lower our levels of stress. They help us heal from illness, and they fill our lives with meaning and our hearts with love. And that's what today's show is all about. My first guest is a passionate veterinarian, a doctor of veterinary medicine, who also has a doctorate in falcon medicine and more than 25 years of experience in the field. Dr. Margit Gabrielle Mueller has many talents. She's a renowned international speaker who shares her knowledge, experience, and ideas and provides inspiration to countless individuals. She's an award-winning author. Her book, Your Pet, Your Pill, 101 Inspirational Stories, How Pets Lead You to a Happy, Healthy, and Successful Life, not only shows how much animals enrich and improve our lives, but also provides readers with a clear and a structured approach to review our own individual lives to discover where pets can bring us health, happiness, and comfort. Dr. Mueller, I am truly honored to have you on the show with me today. It's a great pleasure to be on your show, Dr. Ching. I've read about you and your work, and it is so fascinating. I really want to talk about what you share in your book, Your Pet, Your Pill. But before that, I want our viewers to get a glimpse into who you are, and into your amazing work in Abu Dhabi. By profession, I'm a veterinarian. And as you correctly said, I work since 25 years with Falcons, apart from the small pets. And I'm the executive director of the Abu Dhabi Falcon Hospital, which is the largest hospital for Falcons in the world. It is a different world, actually. And it is a place where you can bring all your talents together. My love is animals. In the same time, I'm also a certified life coach and an NLP master, so everything comes together. And this has shown over the years, not just that animals are just special and falcons are just amazing, but they can do so much for us, which is incredible. Well, in your book, these words of yours struck me. Life is so much more enriched, fulfilled, and beautiful through the unconditional love, joy, and beauty that dogs and pets bring to our lives. I cannot imagine a life without their presence and love. I want to share my love of animals with the world to make it a better place, to let people experience this wonderful feeling. So in a nutshell, tell us how animals do this. My message in my book is that pets lead us to edge as edge, health, success, and happiness. Animals can nurture our souls. They can heal our bodies, our minds, and our heart. And in the same time, they are loving us with their unconditional love in a way that it helps us even to love ourselves more. And this is what makes it so special. And this bond with an animal is just unique. That love is, is really important. Um, your book is full of stories. So tell us your favorite story about how animals have brought happiness to someone that you know or that you've worked with. Usually we always think that just dogs or cats can bring happiness into our lives. But for every person, there might be even a different animal. Like, for example, I had rescued some horses from a place where they had been beaten and, and abused. And one of those horses, which had been, you can say, the deputy lead mayor, she had a foal. And when I came to visit her, she was in a forest clearing far away from me. And when she saw me coming, she let her foal alone and came running towards me. 
And once she reached me, she nudged me in my tummy. She was really, you know, nuzzling me. And this love that such an abused animal has, the trust that she had built in me, she knew that I rescued her. This is a happiness that you cannot even describe. I bet in the same way that we bring comfort to animals' lives too. Definitely. What, what about health? Uh, how can pets help us to improve our health and our well-being? Oh, pets have a huge impact on our physical health and well-being, but also on our mental health and well-being. When we look at the physical side, yes, we know that pets make us happy, but a lot of people don't know that even through just three to five minutes interaction with your pet, just cuddling your pet releases hormones in your body. It releases well-being hormones, endorphins. It releases happy hormones, dopamines, and even the love hormone uh, oxytocin gets excreted. So this means there is a physiological change that's taking place in our body. I can't tell you how much it's been a pleasure spending this time with you today. This is great information you've shared with us. So please tell us where our viewers can go to learn more about you. Well, you can know more about me when you go to my website, www.margetmuller.com. And you can find me also on social media, like on Facebook, uh, Dr. M.G. Mueller, or on Instagram, dr.market.muller, or on Twitter, uh, Dr. Underscore M Market MG. And uh, at the same time, I would be happy to hear from the audience because I'm sure there are so many beautiful stories out there, what pets did for you as well. And it will be lovely if you become part of the Your Pet, Your Pill community. Well, thank you so much. I appreciate you spending this time. We'll be right back with more of Finding the Good Life in one minute.